Welcome to the Process Model Training Series. This is video 10 of 11 basic videos. In this video, you will learn why animation is important and options available during the animation. The animation is vital to validating a model. Animation proves the flow. Animation tests choices for advanced routing. Animation provides a visual test for detailed logic. Animation speeds the process of validating a model. Animation provides a quick method to gain approval from process experts. The expert can observe many details of the process quickly, leading to the needed changes and to approval. Animation assures understanding from the viewers, from the CEO to the process users. Getting people on the same page is simple because they can see how the process works and how it might work in the future. Once the simulation is started, there are several simple adjustments to refine the animation. The speed of the animation is changed by moving the slider bar at the top of the screen. A slower animation allows details to be observed. A faster animation allows context of what's happening over time. Pan through the layout by holding down the mouse button and dragging the direction the layout is to be moved. Use the Options menu to find animation adjustments. Animation Off turns off the animation. Off increases the speed many times. The animation may be turned on again by selecting the same menu item. Zoom zooms in or out of the layout. Zoom to fit enlarges a small model to fit the screen and shrinks a large model to show the overview. Want to know the nitty gritty of what's happening during the simulation? Trace lists detailed events as they happen during the simulation. This allows the user to see exactly what and when events are occurring. This can provide incredible insight when attempting to understand the order of events. This option allows step-by-step -step viewing and saving the trace to a file. Events can be filtered so only select events are shown. Pause the animation temporarily by selecting the Alt key. Pause at a specific time by using the user defined pause. In this video, you've learned why the animation is important and options available during the animation. In the next video, you'll learn how to get the output that you want. 